To insert a page break in Microsoft Word, first we want to start by placing the cursor wherever we want the page break to begin. So let's say we want this paragraph, this last paragraph, to start on the next page. Well, we'd put our cursor right there at the front, and then click on the Insert tab. Then here in the Pages section, we could just click Page Break. And that'll insert a whole new page break. Now, what we also want to do is look at the formatting. Let's click on the Home tab, and in the Paragraph section, we'll click on this backwards P, and that'll show and reveal all the formatting happening. So we can see if there's a paragraph here. If we scroll up, we'll see where we inserted the page break here. So if we wanted to undo that, well, we could just put our cursor right there and delete it. And we'll delete that one too. Great. Now there's some other formatting options. If we go to the Page Layout tab, we'll see in the Page Setup, there's a whole drop-down menu for breaks. We can insert a page break or even just a section break that'll allow the formatting to only happen in this section. So if I wanted to change the margins, So maybe I want to put a quote or something else there in the middle. That's an easy way to change the formatting just for this section. So there's a couple options there when formatting your Word document.